Hello and morning. This is another day in my work life and another day when I'm working from home, which is why I can film confidently over here because I have no courage to do that in the office. Anastasia from the future here and I realized I forgot to properly introduce myself in case you're new here. So hello, my name is Anastasia, I'm 25 years old, I'm based in London and about a year ago I started my job in consulting in a big four firm. So I'll take you along, I'll show you what I'm doing, tell you a bit more about my work and kind of what it involves on my project at the moment. I have cheated a little bit, I've already washed my face, brushed my teeth, I put a bit of makeup on to feel more alive. Now I'm gonna quickly make myself some coffee, make myself breakfast and I have a call at 9.30. Thankfully my 9am was cancelled which is why I can in a relaxed way tell you about my day and then start a bit later. Okay, breakfast done, coffee's done. I don't really have the time to eat my breakfast before my call, so probably save it for later. But also the reality of working from home is that <laughs> I need to put this away because it's right in the frame and we're gonna do that now. <laughs> Okay, I actually got quite lucky with the timings because my manager is saying to start the check-in, the meeting we have 15 minutes later. So I think I might actually squeeze in my workout slash stretch now because I love doing that most work days, sometimes weekends as well. And I do find that my day goes better when I do get it done because I've got some movement. Like I, I genuinely feel more productive once I've done it. I'm going to do that now. It's nothing intense, by the way. It's so actually just a few stretches, a couple of exercises, but... Very nice in the morning. Okay, I just had my first meeting of the day. It was very nice. I honestly love my manager. She was great. So we went through the priorities for the day and then for the rest of the week as well and when we want to do certain things, when we want to prepare particular packs to brief leadership team and then to do the status update for the whole program because our project is a very small project. It's just two of us. But it's within a bigger program for this client and the program includes like probably 10 different projects and work streams going on. I have a very full day of meetings today, so I'm going to be on calls most of it, to be honest. I have at least maybe five or six today. So it's going to be a day of juggling calls, but also trying to do the actual work in between them. I have another call coming up now in 10 minutes with one of our work stream leads for the wider program. So we're going to give him an update of what's going on, where we're at, we made some progress yesterday with getting out a briefing pack to someone who needed to see it. I also have a lot of side of desk things going on today. One is for a conference we're organizing for people who are leading their organization's digital area. So it's going to be a really cool three-day program with speakers that are both from my firm but also external and really exciting stuff because I love events. That's my background before consulting. So I very much try to pick my side of desk stuff so that it matches what I genuinely you love doing but whenever you have an exciting event and it all looks very cool and interesting there is of course a huge time in the lead up where you're doing a lot of day-to-day -day admin you're chasing people you're trying to get in touch with our leadership team so that they nominate their clients for this so it's a lot of that going on at the moment and it kind of is the price you pay for the exciting stuff at the end of it so i'm very happy doing it but i do also have to juggle it with my client stuff and client work is a priority in consulting and then on top of that you're supposed to be doing side of desk so today i have quite a mix and i'm gonna try and squeeze in as much as possible but yeah for now i'm gonna take the nine minutes i have left to do a little bit of work and then jump onto the next call with our program lead hello morning how you doing? Okay, I'm done with 
two of my calls for today. I have another one coming up right now in a minute. So thankfully, my previous call finished five minutes early. So I had time to run to bathroom, come back here, tell you this, and then log back on to the next call. And the next one is about my side of desk thing, that conference that I told you about. So we're having a wider team check in with the partners who are sponsoring this and also us, the organizing team. I'm going to give a quick update on the numbers, how we're doing with client domination. <laughs> Here's a reminder. Okay, I'm gonna log back on. Hello vlog. It's actually been a few hours since I last spoke with you and I've just had this couple of calls and then I've been trying to do desktop preview essentially of the documentations that our client sent us. So that's been my priority activity this week. And then obviously I have to do other things in the background as well. So that's been my day, but I'm feeling so sleepy and I have another call coming up in 15 minutes. In the meantime, I'm having a snack and then I'm gonna put a lasagna in the oven, which is it's already pre-made, I just have to put it in and then it'll take half an hour. Very excited for that, I got it yesterday and then I was supposed to have it for dinner but then I didn't so I'm very glad I saved it. And my snack in the meantime includes these bad boys. This is the trio of olives from the good old Sainsbury's and then cracker, cheese and then salami on top. I'm gonna have that now. I also had a decaf cappuccino but kind of regretting the decaf part of it because I'm very sleepy. The weather is not helping as well. It's very like rainy and grey and it's also cold everywhere so I could just sleep for the rest of the day to be honest. But yeah, got this call coming up and then the other two calls I was supposed to have today, they actually got rescheduled to tomorrow and next week so my day is a bit freer than I thought it would be which is great. I'm putting some music on because I need the energy to finish this working day. Kind of worried I'll get the copyright claim <laughs> if I put this out. So just going to quickly say that keeping the desk review going, so I'm still reviewing documents and I'm going to power through the last hour and then hopefully log off around like a reasonable time. <laughs> And we're done. We're done meaning that honestly I'm so tired I need to log off and wrap this up. It was quite an okay work day but it wasn't my most productive to be honest and I think partly because I am at home I don't work as productively here unless it's super time pressure then then I actually have to get things done in the timeline. So today was a bit more of a case of I had a ton of meetings planned so I thought it doesn't matter where I take them I wanted to spare the commute and just to start my day in a slightly more relaxed way. But overall it was a good day. I felt like I needed a home day because it was getting a bit too fast paced for me with every single morning doing the commute and then it's so packed on the tube it's literally like a stressful start to the day and it's not nice and then I keep rushing everywhere, have evening plans, have everything back to back and it was getting a bit too much so this week I tried to keep my week more relaxed and give myself more breathing space. So yeah, that's a wrap up for today. Thank you for joining me. If you have any questions on the work that I do or anything else about working and consulting, do let me know and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.